Hey guys, Maka here from Melee.co and in this episode of The Lab I'm going to show you how to practice edge guarding Fox and getting him to mix up the edge guard so you can just practice it over and over. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into a game. So we've just got Fox as a CPU, that doesn't really matter. Let's go into Battlefield. All right, and the first thing that we're gonna do is actually turn this into developer mode. So to do that, we pause and we press right on the D-pad. We want 20XX on and develop on. So that's good. So now to pause, we do X plus D-pad up is to pause and unpause. Okay, but we also have this cool feature where if we press the start button, it pauses the animation and we can move through each frame with Z, or if we press start again, we can just bring it back to regular gameplay. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and pause that. Now we press down on the D-pad, and here we can control the different players. And so by toggling through the different players, we can see player one, that's me at the moment. I'm gonna press the R key, uh, R trigger. We're now doing player three. So I want player three to be controlled. No, what I want, okay, I want, to change this 20XX CPU type to stay. So that's all we need to do there. And then we press down on the D-pad to hide that screen again. I'm now gonna unpause and we'll see that Fox is just staying there. I'm gonna rack up some damage on this little buddy of mine. 50% is pretty good. Now we've got Fox near the ledge. That's kind of where we want him. So we're going to save state by pressing right on the D-pad. And now if I move around, if I press left on the D-pad, it takes me back there. So as you can see, jump around, press left on the D-pad. If I go ahead and kill Fox and myself, you now we can see we're both at 0% there. If I press left, then we go back to this situation. So I wanna save that state and be able to save the state. So now what I'm gonna do is just, I'm gonna grab Fox and we'll see that in that situation, he, you know, side B back to the stage, and in that one he up beats. So he's going to do all the mix-ups based on, I'm pretty sure it's just based on his DI. So whatever DI he does, the recovery option will be the same. But we can now go ahead and practice edge guarding Fox in different ways. Anyway. That is how you practice edge guarding on 20XX against Fox. You're going to have to work out, you know, the best position to have him in so you can save that state and practice those edge guards. I really want to work out how can I get Fox to DI up high, but I haven't quite worked that out yet.